Hey guys! In this tutorial I will show you how to clone game objects using C Sharp in Unity. So let's get started. First we create a cube and then we want to clone this cube 10 times in a row. So I make a right click in our hierarchy, hover over 3D object and select cube. I set its position to 0, 0, 0. Okay. The next thing we're gonna do, we will create a script which then clones the cube 10 times. So go to the project window, make a right click, hover over create and select C sharp script. And we will call it game object cloner. Make a double click on it to open it. And here we will need our cube. So I type public game object cube. And when the game starts, we want to clone the cube 10 times. So I make a for loop. With the variable i. And yeah, so everything inside here gets called 10 times. Now we have to clone our, our cube. Um, that's very easy in Unity. You just have to call the method instantiate and as input we give the game object that we want to clone. So in this case we want to instantiate our cube. We also want to change some values of its components. So I make a variable game object. Oops. I make a variable game object and I call it clone. So now we assigned the new clone to our clone game object and we can set its position, we can change its material, whatever. Um, we want to transform the position and um, we want to set it to the x position should be i times 3 and the y and the z position should be 0. So i increments every time and so this should result in a row of clones. We hit, uh, we, we save our script, go back to unity and now we have to drag and drop our script on the main camera or somewhere else. Um, okay, whoops, now I got it two times. I just removed it once. Yeah, you can see in the inspector that your script is now attached to the main camera and it has this cube attribute, but the game object is missing. So we drag and drop our cube, which we want to clone to our cube attribute. And if we hit play now, you can see that the cube gets cloned 10 times. Yeah. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.